Pharmacogenomics, or PGX, has incredible potential, but it's also not easy. The first and biggest barrier is coordination. PGX requires a range of stakeholders throughout the healthcare ecosystem to work together. Stakeholders that might not be used to coordinating. The second, third, and fourth barriers have to do with resources. Organizations need the right staff, technology, and funding to create and sustain their program. Staff need to have the right expertise to monitor changing guidelines, interpret genetic lab results, adjust medication regimens appropriately, and explain the implications to their patients in a way that's easy to understand. PGX requires technology to process testing, receive genetic test results, and store those results for future use, all in a way that fits into existing workflows. And finally, funding. The funding needs to cover the staffing and technology investments. Programs can get creative about using existing resources and working with payers to secure reimbursement and sustain program growth. These barriers are hard, but the potential impact that PGX can have on the way we treat patients is worth it.